Can the government cause hurricanes? After Hurricane Milton smashed through Florida, some have claimed the government created it through cloud seeding or other nefarious means. But when you understand how cloud seeding works, you'll realise that this is, well, it just doesn't make sense. Cloud seeding involves spraying a chemical called silver iodide into the air to bring water droplets together, form clouds, and then rain. And while it can increase rainfall by about 10% or more, it can't create water from nothing. But hurricanes aren't just rain. They're produced by vast amounts of energy moving through the atmosphere. Cloud seeding has no impact on that. To form hurricanes, you need warm oceans and the heat energy to evaporate enough water to form vast storm clouds. Just think how much energy it takes to evaporate a litre of water, and how many trillions of litres of water are in a hurricane. Cloud seeding can't provide this energy, and there's no technology on the planet that could do that. What can play a role, though, is global heating. And although humans probably didn't cause the hurricane, we almost certainly made it worse. In fact, over 90% of the heat trapped by the gases we've released has been absorbed by the ocean. And warmer oceans make hurricanes more powerful. So no, the government can't cause hurricanes. But human activity can, and has, made them worse. Don't forget to like and follow the cooldown for more climate content.